I'm Mark Reed. I'm the director of maintenance at Abilene Arrow. We're going to go out in the shop and walk around, see what we can see, and uh, see if we can come up with a maintenance item or two. But when you're doing a take a cylinder off, it's easier to access lifters. And this lifter has been chewed around the edges, and that's in and of itself not necessarily detrimental. But when you look in at the camshaft and you see you can hook a spot on the camshaft, well then you have to tear the engine down and replace the camshaft. So we have both engines on this airplane are in that shape. The next side is bad. We looked at the lifter on this side, and that one's really bad. It's uh, been chewed on on the whole face. The face should look smooth like this, and we're finding this kind of issue more and more often with Continental engines. So, what's the cause of it? Um, I, you know, it, it's got to be a defect on the camshaft, or the lifter face was just too soft. And they, they just wear, it's metal to metal wear with just an oil cushion. And that oil is just splashed on there. It's not pressured onto it. It's just splashed on it. For the most part, you know, that the engines run fairly well. But that metal wearing on it, having a, if there's a defect on either surface of any kind, they're just going to sit there and grind each other apart. So inspecting the oil filter on the oil change, Maybe doing oil samples uh, will show you that that metal is being eaten up in that side of that engine. You'll see that as iron in the, in the oil sample. Are there inclinations that that buildup is happening prior to them bringing it in and doing maintenance work? On this one, we, did, we didn't have any idea that it was. We've done a couple oil changes. We, we you know, uh, like I say, we only looked at the lifters because we had full three cylinders. So, uh, then we, when we find bad lifters on one, you wonder about the other. And we just pulled one lifter out and found the bad one. So now when you when you see a Continental engine, is that something that you're gonna be on the lookout for? I, I you know, lately I have gotten, uh, we had an issue a couple years ago, a guy wanted to do a pre-purchase on a Bonanza. And uh, in the log book, they had actually been documenting that they were finding iron in the oil filter and samples showed up as iron. And so we plan for a pre-purchase to pull some lifters out. You know, it, it takes about an hour per cylinder to pull a lifter out. And so the first lifter I pulled out happened to be the one that had the problem. And we, we actually pulled the engine out and sent it to Continental. It was just a little bit out of warranty, but Continental warrantied that for us. They changed the camshaft, put new lifters in it, and sent it back to us. And uh, that's just a repair. It doesn't go back to a zero since major overhaul or anything like that. It's just a repair. But we haven't had any trouble with that engine since we did that particular item. So, um, you know, keeping an eye on, make sure you, what's in your filter. Uh, if you have any magnetic particles, it's probably iron. And, uh, you know, if it's more than just a little bit of fuzz, probably have a lifter.